No, but this was better than it did last time. We are live now. I don't know what the heck's going on with YouTube Live recently. It's like I have to go through like 50 steps in order to get it to actually work. I, I, have to like, I feel like we just always have a problem. doesn't matter what we're I trying to, to do. I have to like turn off one camera and then turn on another camera and then turn off another camera. And it's Hello. Like, what is going on? Hi, hi, hi. Hi, everyone. Oh, by the way, we're live today. Oh, yeah. So oh. sorry. This was sort of a surprise uh, live show. <laughs> That's what I, that's my. Hello. Have we been to Maria and Enzo's? You went. I went. Yeah. I didn't get to try it out, but Tim went. I'm in class right now. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. Should you not, like, be Hi in from class the UK. Right now? What, are you, what? I mean, should you not be watching <laughs> this in class? I'm sorry. Um, favorite Disney character. Mine is Marie from the Aristocats. And Enzo. From Maria and Enzo's. <laughs> what is Maria and Enzo's from? Is that something? It's a made up thing. Oh, okay. Gotcha. Hello. Thank you. Okay. So here's the plan oh, for today. We did a live show last week. Was it last week? Yeah. I think it was last week. Yeah. We're trying to be more like consistent with doing them every week. And we didn't get to open any mail at all because we hadn't done a live show for so long that I think we were just like, we just wanted to really chat with you guys and see. Um, you know, how everything was going and all that. Yeah. So I feel like this week we are going to try to get through some mail for sure. We have to get through, um, not get through, that sounds bad. We need to open the mail that you guys have sent us because yeah. um, we found a box of mail that I don't even think that we knew was here. Yeah. So I think we missed mail from many, many months ago, not just two months ago. <laughs> Yeah. So we need to open this mail because it's been um, sitting here unopened for months. So yeah. we're very sorry to the people that sent us mail back in. I feel like it's like June or something. The this, summertime. Look, right here. There's a there's a uh, date on that one right there. That April. Literally says that was from April. April. Yeah. So this is just like a, a lost box. Yeah. Um, the lost mail. Yeah. Also, just really quick um, as well. The mailbox is closed. So we do want to make sure that that's like super clear. Um, don't send us mail because it will be returned back to you. Right. And we don't want you guys to like waste your postage. But this is mail that we have had since before our mailbox closed. Right. So again, and it is closed. Don't send us any mail. This is one of the reasons that we had to close it is because like we. We, we were so backed up. We can't keep up. Yeah. We don't have anywhere to put it. Um, it's. Well, it was just we were getting so far behind that it seems like not fair for you guys to send us something and then we don't open it right away. So you're not ever going to see us open it. You know what I mean? Right. So I think we just we had to close the box. Maybe we'll open it back up again one day if it's still available. But it's just we cannot keep it open. I'm yeah. so sorry. <laughs> I feel terrible. Um, but one of the one of the little packages that we got. Oh, sorry. So really quick with the super chats. Yeah. Um, please don't send any super chats because we're we won't be able to answer comments and super chats and open the mail in enough time to actually get anything done. Right. Right. Like. Right. So yeah. what we're going to do is we're going to open mail, and we're going to try to like read the comments. Like Jen will open a mail and I'll read a comment, and then I'll open a mail and read a, and Jen will read a comment. Yeah, we're going to try to. We. It's hard to do like all three things. I think that's what our problem is. Is when we get through. All of the, I keep saying when we get through, that sounds really mean. When we open that, because we are very excited and, and happy that you guys have sent us anything at all. Um, but I think that we are so behind that we just want to make sure that we open all this mail. Yeah. <laughs> like, I feel so terrible that we haven't opened it. So we're going to do that more so than anything else in this live show. Is right. that okay? Um uh, let's see here. Hello from rainy Manchester. <laughs> oh, uh, no. It's not raining here, surprisingly. Hi, Alyssa. Yeah. Um, do you want to answer, answer these? these really quick? Yeah, sure. Okay. Uh, yeah, I do one of the pepperoni. <laughs> Chris, the Shriner dog, says, Morning, trackers. Hope you all are doing well. Morning. Thank you. It's 3.30 here. Maybe they live in Hawaii. Maybe, yeah. But thank you so much. We appreciate it. We hope you're doing well, too. Uh, Jacob says, will you guys ever become wilderness explorers? Yes, we will. We became wilderness explorers a while ago. Did we? Yeah. But we need to do it again. Yeah. For sure. We totally do. 
Uh, Casper says, oh, no, I'm working. Love you all. Uh, much love to you all. And I can't wait to catch up on all your videos after I'm finished moving Thursday. Oh, congratulations. Because I'm a lady. That's why. <laughs> <clears throat> um, I love it. I hope that we don't get you in trouble for watching us at work. I know. Yeah. A lot of you guys are saying that you're at work in school. Don't be careful. Yeah. I mean, well, do be careful. <laughs> I was going to say, don't do that and be careful. Right. But follow the rules. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, Matthew says, hello from Biloxi. Hello. Love your show working. Two jobs is hard to ever take time off to visit Disney World. Maybe one day. Oh, dang. Yeah, yeah. maybe one day. It'll definitely be there still when you um, are ready. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully. What? Where's it going? Mm -hmm. You never know. <laughs> I think it'll be there forever. <laughs> um, a lot of people are asking if the hallowed, the holiday parties are worth the money. The... Um, the Christmas party? Christmas party and the Halloween party. And I would say, for me personally, I say yes. But what I would also say is watch a video. It doesn't have to be our video, but watch a video. We do have videos on all of those things. But um, watch a video on the event that is maybe like a full encompassing video of the event, like an overview. And then kind of see for yourself what you think. Because yeah. what we think is worth it may not be worth it to you or to your family. So that's what I would say. Yeah, and it's always hard to say whether or not something is worth it or not because worth it mean is subjective. It really is. It really depends on a lot of different things. So that's why I we kind of just put out these overview videos so that you can see for yourself what you think rather right. than us tell you, like, you should do this. Because I, I don't know. I don't feel weird. <laughs> like, I don't think that it's worth it for uh, Kanye West what? to buy a Lamborghini. What does that mean? But he probably would like to buy a Lamborghini. Oh, I see. Okay. So just like yeah. any rich person. Yeah. Um, we did get another super chat from Graham who said, if you could only renew one AP, which one? I, for me, it would be Disney. Yeah. Also, please don't send any more super chats because we are not going to be answering them <laughs> until the mm -hmm. very end of this of this live show. So, um, but Disney for sure. Um, so we did get a package from the Neverland family. And they sent us a couple of shirts and they sent us some shirts uh, a while back that, that I actually wear all the time. But this one is the Grim Getting Ghost Come Out to Socialize. Ooh, it like kind of drove the camera crazy. It's haunted. Right? And then this one is so fun. It says mirror, mirror on the wall. And it's like a really nice black shirt. I, Wait, loved, I what like is, the quality. What is the rest of that quote? Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who's the fairest of them all? Is but it's that? supposed to be magic mirror on the wall. You were trying oh, to do the first mirror. thing. Yeah. That's so thank you so much to the Neverland family for the awesome shirts. And um, we really appreciate you guys thinking about us. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you guys. Yeah. Okay. A lot of people are saying like 500,000 hype. Oh, okay. What do you guys think we should do for 500,000? I actually have an idea that um, I want to see if we can do it. It's something that I don't know if we can actually do it, but I would like to. Real quick, um, what? somebody just said editing advice for a beginner, and I thought it said eating advice. No. Oh, and I was like, oh. I just learned how to eat. <laughs> um, oh, okay. What, right. were you, what were you going to say about 500000 Well, I it's not. I, I want to tell you first. Oh, it's a surprise? Yeah, like it would be like a cool surprise for, for a video. Ride Kumba 500,000 times. Oh, my God. Whoa. I feel like you would die. <laughs> Um, I feel like tattoos are like, I, I don't, you're more of a tattoo person. Yeah. I feel like you should get like a YouTube tattoo, Okay, but I don't know. Is that, I feel like everybody does that. Is that a thing? Yeah. I mean, Adam got the five. Right. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. Um, what would I get? 500,000? No. <laughs> what if I got five hamburgers tattooed on me? What if you did? What if I got... Gene Belcher doing a burger dab <laughs> tattooed on me. Where would it go? You don't really have an area it for that. It would go right there. Would it? Like full size, full body, Gene Belcher. Would that be no tattoos? Somebody said no tattoos. I don't know. What do you guys think? What if I got... 500,000 in calories. I think you would die from that. B-R-G-R. -R beef squash. Yeah, we, you should get dab. the beef squash tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> beef squash is my favorite. That's funny. Um, is there a date for celebration of Harry Potter? I don't think so. I think they, they're not doing it anymore. Oh, they're not? Right. What do you mean? Where are they doing it? They're not doing celebration, right? Sorry, my hair is being really weird. Um, I didn't know or that. Or am I thinking of Rock the Universe? Um, no, they, yeah, they moved Rock the Universe to February when celebration was. Celebration now is they in do, January, I thought. 
yeah, they moved, they moved Rock the Universe to that. Now they're doing like Homecoming or whatever it is for Harry Potter. A 500,000 second live stream. What would that be? 500,000 seconds. That's a 500,000 seconds. 600 <laughs> seconds. See the Egyptian tattoo. No tattoo. But you guys do know that he has tattoos already, right? Because maybe that's why they don't want you to get a tattoo. Because they don't want you to like. 88,333 minutes. Oh, that's a lot. 138 oh, hours. Oh, oh hours. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, 138 minutes. We've done that. That's a lot. 138 hours. That's, Holy cow. That's, that's that. There's a movie that's less time than that. Oh, yeah. The guy had to cut his arm off. 127 hours. Um, you could use the mustache and put a five in front of it. What? Could. Could do that. Get the Bob's Burger tattoo. I like it. Um, I, I mean, I do like Bob's Burgers. I just don't know that I like Bob's Burgers that much. What do you mean? I think it's more about the burger than it's about Bob's Burgers. Yeah. I think I have to get like a bobby pin to put my hair back because it's making me a little bit crazy. Ding dang. Yeah. Can you get me one though? Where you, is it? I, or can you get out easier than I can? I don't know. Uh, nobody pay attention to the loud noise that's about to happen when oh, I unplug the microphone. Oh, is it going to make a noise? Don't do it then. Never mind. I'll okay. just live. I'll live through it. Okay. You guys, just it's going to look weird. How do we go bit. from 500,000 to Bob's Burgers? <laughs> Tattoo five hidden Mickeys. How do you, if they're hidden. They're all on my butt. <laughs> <laughs> Could you imagine just having five Mickeys tattooed on your butt? That would be weird. <laughs> um, so, okay. So we did get a package from... Emma, Matt, Freddie, and Dexter. Um, and they just wanted to say thanks for the vlogs. They came to Disney. We missed them because this was from August. We are so sorry oh, no. that we missed these. This There's just these this box of stuff that I don't know how we missed it. So yeah. I'm super, super sorry about that. Um, dang, I don't know if we met you, but um, hopefully we did. And they said happy birthday to Dexter, whose birthday was on the 6th of September. Sorry, Dexter. That was happy birthday. Dexter. We missed it. Ding dang. We hope you had a really amazing birthday. Um, and then they went to Disneyland, or they're going to Disneyland in 2019, and they're very excited. So oh. we're very excited. We hope you have an amazing time. And um, they sent over this super cute Marie pajama top, which so I fabulous. I have this already, and so it's nice. I'll well, have then a little it's for me. Well, okay, or it's for you. I was gonna say I have a backup. Some London socks. Some Tsum Tsum lip glosses, oh. right? Are they lip glosses? They're squishies. Oh, they're not lip glosses, but that's cool. That's squishy. Um, a poncho. Oh, and there's a hidden Tsum Tsum in there. A, um, see what it is? a uh, Union Jack wallet. wallet. I'm like, what is this? A wallet. Right? That's Some, the Union Jack, right? Yes, it is. Some erasers that are like little mustache guy. And then a drawing by Dexter, who is now six, which is pretty awesome. And a drawing by Freddie, which is also pretty awesome. So thank you guys so much for thinking of us. And we're so sorry that it took us so long to open this. Here's um, my problem. These are called squishy Tsum Tsums, and they are not squishy at all. They're like slightly squishy. Oh, no. I think they're great. <laughs> I've got that song from Rent stuck in my head. Oh, no, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm going to start a pile over here. Okay. What was this, a poncho? Yeah. That's nice. I know. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is exciting. Don't throw things. Um, This is from... Somebody just said, can we please read this? Yes. Yes. Oh, somebody suggested that for 500,000, we eat five-foot-long tattoos. Or th tattoos. Five-foot-long hot dogs. <laughs> Five foot long, hot, like a foot. A five foot long hot dog. Oh, oh that sounds gross. Oh, <laughs> um, okay, so we got a really awesome letter from, I don't know if you wrote your name on here. They put their Instagram. Kay's Disney Life. But I don't know. Maybe it's on the, it just says K. K. Okay. Well, I don't know um, what your, if maybe K is your name, but you sent over a cool package um, giving us some really awesome tips for pin trading. And we are going to be doing a pin trading vlog soon, which I'm very excited about. They also sent over a super cute Halloween bow. Oh, that's I wonder spooky. If I should put this in to put my hair back. Oh, yeah. 
Let's see how that looks. Do we have any update on the new Space Mountain exit? Not yet. What is it? What do you mean? Like. Oh, no, I don't have like. Oh, look think? at that. Okay. It's perfect. Cool. Well, it holds my hair back perfectly. Thank you. Um, so she also sent over some awesome lanyards and pins for pin trading and some information on how to pin trade, um, like pin trading 101. So that is also Ooh. very exciting. Oh, no. I think I broke one off and it's going to poke me. Okay. You hold that one. Is this the one that's dangerous? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Maybe. No, um, all my backs are on there. Oh, are they? Okay. Yeah. Then it's, we're all good. We're good to go. Did so, you, yo, did, this one was mine. Did she make these? I think so. Yeah. And they're so cute. I love it. So we're going to do some pin trading here um, pretty soon. So it's very exciting. And we just wanted to say thank you so much for thinking of us. And we will definitely use all of your pin trading tips. Don't get a pin jury. Amazing. I love that. <laughs> That's amazing. Um, and then um, thank you so much for you had a little letter to read off camera. And I just want to say thank you so much for sharing that with us. We really do appreciate it. And this is so cute. I love this. Thank you. Yeah. Can you read oh, this? Do you play shark. Roblox? No, we you actually don't. don't have any video gaming systems. Like I think Roblox is on the computer, right? Which we just have our editing computers. So we. This is another one from last year. From last this year? This is from last year's Horror Nights. This was a letter from Aaron and Mia and kids. And it's from a company called. Sugarless? Yeah, you they they were saying you're. I I heard that you were in need of some theme shirts, so we're super excited for this year's HHN Ash versus Evil Dead Trick or Treat. Um, we won't be doing the unmasking tour, but look forward to hearing and seeing your thoughts if you do. Um, so they included a zombie Blinky shirt, which is the the Blinky the fish, the three eyed fish. Okay. And so I took that stuff out of this box and I washed it. It's in the closet. Yeah. But we never opened these on camera. We didn't. No. Huh. So I don't know. I don't know what happened with this particular box. Like I'm not sure. Um, is anybody? Is anybody here? Remember the zombie, like Blinky, the three-eyed fish from uh, Simpsons. Tank. Does anybody remember us opening that? I don't. I I really don't think we did. And then we also had a like a pizza, like a drippy, scary yeah. pizza shirt. I look That's at that also, shirt every day. I know. And so, um, thank you so much for sending these shirts over. I'm so sorry that. Oh. Everybody says most definitely yes, yes. Did we? Well, why is it in here? Did we open this box? I don't know. I'm this, so confused. We are well, thank you again very confused. to um, Aaron and Mia for sending that stuff over and for the awesome like stickers and stuff. But I'm very confused as to what, because there's some stuff in this box that we definitely didn't open. Right. So what the heck am I doing? I definitely didn't open this one. Yeah, I don't even know what this is. They're pool clothes. Well, I am so sorry. This is another reason why we had to stop the mail because like we just can't keep up with it. Um, how about a 500 minute live park vlog, eight hours? Holy cow. Um, so I know that you guys have asked us to live stream in the parks. And I know that there are a lot of people that do that. Unfortunately, Disney actually like asked us not to do that yeah. because it's like too much. When we had our meetup and uh, we had a, like a line of people they were not happy about that. Right. So we can't do the live show because that's basically like inviting, you know, it's like, here I am. Like, and yeah. so they were like, please don't um, do that. So we can't live stream from the parks because we don't want to make Disney mad. And I feel like it's, we want to keep our like pass. Like we like going to Disney. Right. <laughs> so, um, uh, but yeah, so there's, I'm sure there are like tons of other live streams that you can watch though. So a 500 flight mile, 500 mile flight. Where would that take us? Not very far. Where would so 500,000 like, miles take us? Oh, 500,000 miles. That's a good question. That would take us around the world like a lot of times. <laughs> so this is a, a Tootsie Roll uh, pool float. This is from Patrick, and he says that he knows that we collect food related pool floats. So he saw these and had to get them. Um, so he, he loves the HHN videos and the Disneyland videos and 
See, this is again from last year though. That's so strange. I don't understand where, where this box, like how did this box get so hidden? I don't know. Um, but he said, thank you so much for making him smile and laugh for the videos. He really enjoys them. And we just want to say thank you, Patrick, for sending us some really cute food related. I think this one's Smarties. I think this one is Smarties. Yeah. So that's exciting. Thank you so much. Now Fine. we have a Tootsie Roll and the Smarties um, thing. Somebody said that um, the Earth's cir circumference is 24,000 miles. Oh, so we would literally have to go to. We would go around the world. Like how eight many times? times? <laughs> no, more than that. Eight is two hundred thousand. <laughs> I feel like what? sixteen. What we would that that 18 would be times. That would take us until we die. Like oh, that's how long would that be? Well, I don't know. Uh oh. So this one I don't think we opened because this letter isn't opened. Yeah. When is this from? Let me see the. It's from 2017. Yeah, this is from 8 29 2017. Oh my gosh. See, I'm, I'm really sorry. Um, so this was from the. Oh, from from the Kaysen family Paul, Tina, Daniel, Joshua, and Isaac. And so. Oh, I was wondering what the smell was. The turkey leg air freshener. <laughs> That's so funny. Um, some like little Disney posty notes. Oh, these are fun. Here they are in front of the tree oh, in front of the tree of life. Sorry, it's blurry. Oh no. There it goes. There they are. Uh oh, it's going blurry, blurry again. again. <laughs> Sorry. But thank you guys for sending that over. Um, so they thought it was funny how you had never had chest pie. And then oh, we yeah. had chest pie, yeah. Um Oh, that's so awesome. So they were celebrating 22 years for their anniversary trip. That was the picture. That's awesome. Um, so Disney is a super special treat for them. And it's their happy place. And they just wanted to say thanks for the vlogs. Thank you, guys. Oh. Oh my gosh, this is actually really cute. So their son um, had an issue like with a stuttering, a stuttering issue with a speech. And so he really liked like YouTube videos. And so he would watch videos and then he wanted to do his own videos. So he would film himself and then it would help him to slow down and yeah. kind of like overcome his um, speech, uh, his stuttering. So that's really cool. I, I love that. Yeah. And his channel is Dan Flicks. Very, Very cool. cool. Well, thank you for sending that and sharing that over. We really do appreciate that. And um, good luck with your with your channel. That's really awesome. And they said that the turkey leg is for the new car. Don't stink it up with that. Just playing. Just thought it was funny. <laughs> <laughs> thank you guys so much. We really appreciate it. Um, and it is very stinky air freshener. So thank you. <laughs> yeah. Any plans for Mickey's 90th? Uh, when is that? I think it's during D23. Oh, okay. During Destination D. That's what I meant. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so the P.O. box is, somebody just asked if the P.O. box was closed or closing. It is closed. Um, however, this mail is, some of this mail is from last year. So that is why we are opening mail because we are a little bit behind on the mail, which is why we mm. had to close the box. So. I forgot to is get there a knife, a knife up, here? up here. Oh, no. no. Let me see it. Okay. Hello from Louisiana. Going to Disney on Christmas. That's awesome. Oh, good afternoon from Donald Dino Bash. Oh, that's fun. Oh my gosh, here's another one that we missed. Ding ding. Um, so we did get a couple of super chats. We got uh, let's see. James said we were in Universal last Thursday. Just missed you after watching your video. You guys are the best, and your vids helped us for HHN. Oh, thank, thank you, you so much. Yeah, we do appreciate that. Um, Kendra said it's my birthday. I'm 20. Love your videos too. Happy, Happy birthday, birthday, Kendra. Yeah, we hope you have an amazing 20th birthday. Uh, ba Bailey says this is the first time I've caught you guys live. Come to Schlitterbahn in Texas. I'll be your guide. Yeah, we have a lot of places that we um, that are on our list. So thank you. We do appreciate it. Really quick, though, um, please don't send any more Super Chats because we won't be able to answer those uh, as frequently because we're trying to get through 
all the mail that we have here. So yeah. no more super chats, please. <laughs> right as we said that, two more came through. I know. I don't want to answer three, them because then more, more come through. in. Yeah, yeah. So we're going to wait to answer those. I know we do see them, but we need to just get through some of this mail with you guys. So we did get a really beautiful picture from the Edwards. Um, this is from Lu Lucia. And she drew this really amazing picture. I love this. I think that's, yeah, that's us in front of the castle. And it says, and now it's time to pay the price. This is so cute. And so um, they love watching the videos and they're planning their next trip in 2019. And they wanted to ask where we would recommend going for dinner for a birthday. Oh, hmm. at Disney? Yeah. Um, so they went to California Grill for another birthday. That place is really good. Yeah. Um, I would say maybe somewhere in Disney Springs. There's a lot of really cool places in Disney Springs. Yeah. And uh, maybe the castle, like Cinderella's Royal Table. That That's was a pretty. Good one. It, the food, I feel like, wasn't the most amazing food ever, but it was a really cool experience. And I feel like for a birthday, it would be pretty special. Yeah. Right? I don't know. That's what I would say personally. But so thank you so much from um, to the Edwards from. Alicia, Lucia, Tim. Oh, and Tim. Oh, wait. Oh, I gotcha. Those are your Instagrams. I see. Okay. Alicia or Alicia, maybe, and Lucia. Thank you both so much. Yeah, thank you, guys. So, uh... Oh, I literally just spilled water on the microphone, I think. Oh, no. That's okay. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I just saw somebody uh, say, sorry, I just spilled water all down my face. So uh, um, saying that they wanted to send me some ears and that they sent me a message on Instagram. Um, I don't, the, the PO box is no longer open, so I, I can't get any mail anyway. Um, so I appreciate the offer. I really do. But there's no way for me to accept them through the mail. So I'm sorry. Thank yeah. you, though. I do appreciate the offer. Is it waterproof? This the microphone? I don't know. No. I hope so. Definitely is not. It's not. No. Okay, so I think now we're on to these. Did you open that? Yeah. Okay. Uh, this is actually really interesting. This is from Plain Crazy Button Club, and this is again from last year. Is it? Yeah. Oh, geez. And they are some haunted mansion themed buttons. Let me see. Oh, it's like the stretching room. That's cool. Oh, yeah, and this is a sticker that says the chamber. This chamber has no windows and no doors. I love that. And then there's also a mystery pin that says it was inspired by the princess and the frog. Oh, blue skies and sunshine, guaranteed. I know it's kind of hard to read because it's yellow and white, but that's it. Pretty neat. Thank you guys so much. Oh, yeah. So, yeah, this is from the Brookhart Project. This is like their pin thing. Yeah. Um, so this is such an old letter because we, I, I don't know, I don't understand where this package went, but um, this was them saying that they were moving to Florida. So there yeah. you go. So congratulations, you guys. And we hope that you guys love it. Yeah. Well, ding, ding. And then we did get a... I don't know. Do you want to check that out? Yeah. This is oh, a this message is for only us. Yes. This is from Juliet, Justin and Aurora. And they sent over some like baking stuff with little mustaches, which I actually have so many of these and I need to um, bake something because I, I, we never, oh, yeah, we never bake anything. <laughs> we never bake anything. Um, and so we just wanted to say, this is them saying thank you for the channel. And, um, Oh, that we've brought a lot of light and happiness. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you. We really appreciate that. And I am, you guys are inspiring me to bake something. So thank you. Thank you guys. So <laughs> oh, and also they sent over, oh, that this is where the straws were. Yeah. I was looking for these. Or, wait, is this a different package? I have no idea. I think this is a different package. Yes. It is. Okay. 
right? Yes. Okay. So Juliet, Justin, and Aurora, thank you so much um, for all the baking stuff. So earlier, we opened some of this mail. We looked at it. At some point, because I saw these metal, these metal straws, and I was like, ooh, when we do our next mail vlog, we'll have some cool straws to use. Yeah. So, this, so when is this from? This was from... Oh my gosh. 2018. 7 28 2018. Dang. So this one's only a couple of months old. But. Okay, cool. Um, so this is from the Dunhams, and they oh they they found our channel when they found out that they were pregnant with triplets. And so they were watching like YouTube videos. Um uh and they had their honeymoon at Disney. And these are their triplets. This is so oh, adorable. <laughs> I love this. It's so adorable. Here they are. And they're wearing their Take Me on a Safari shirts. How stinking cute are they? Um, that would be Natalie, Julia, and Hannah. So much fun. How cute. Oh, my goodness. Um, I've noticed a few videos. You're making an effort not to use plastic straws. And I had an extra set of stainless steel straws. So decided to send them to you. Yeah, this is thank you so much. We really appreciate that. Um, we will definitely be using these. And we super duper appreciate it from Aaron, Abby, Natalie, Julia, and Hannah. Yeah. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Yeah, sorry this took so long to open. But I'm, thank you. I'm excited to use these because apparently stainless steel straws are like make whatever you're drinking super cold. Yeah. So I'm excited. I wonder how like... it should be good for like iced coffee. Yeah. I'm going to have an iced coffee after this. Yeah. Um, Jen's excited. We just got a cappuccino machine. I feel like an, you're excited. An espresso maker. So Sorry. I wanted to, um, I wanted to be able to like, I, I really like caramel macchiatos at Starbucks. Right. Mm -hmm. And so I wanted to drink them, but they're so expensive. Right. I just couldn't like justify spending because they're like five bucks. Yeah. That's like a meal. So I couldn't justify spending that much every time I wanted to have a coffee when I know I could probably make it for cheaper. Mm -hmm. So we got this machine for like a hundred bucks. Yeah. And I feel like maybe it's expensive. Well, we just have to drink uh, 10 caramel macchiatos. What, like well, no. a week? How many? What's 10, what's 10 times five? 50. That's 50. Yeah. So we need to drink 20 of them. 20 a week? No, just, just in general. In general okay, and well, I, for I feel like we've already had ten because, like, as soon as the um, it, it was like an espresso machine, and as soon as it came with the little samples, we just made like fifty-seven coffees. Yeah, we're like, oh, let's taste this one. Let's taste this one, and we're like, <laughs> yeah, super jittery. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, so we got that so that we could maybe spend a little bit less. Yeah. Money, but uh, so this is from Kate, mostly mouse ears. And, oh, so this is actually really fun. She made some Darkwing Duck ears that I can oh, wear yeah. when you have your Darkwing Duck shirt on. I think I got a stain on my Darkwing Duck shirt. Do we so need I haven't to, been wearing it as much. Do we need to get you a new one? Those, those so, are like very difficult to find that shirt, though. Somebody, somebody sent it into you. Um, so this is from Mostly Mouse Ears on Instagram, and this is from Kate. So thank you so much. We really appreciate you sending these over. I like it when people just say stuff like, answer me. <laughs> well, did you? I don't know what they were asking. Did you get the express pass for HHN? We did. We yes. did get the express pass for HHN. That's something Should that I... we are definitely doing more often because there Should have been a lot these? of people at HHN. No? Yeah. I feel like there's another pair of ears in there, so we'll have like a... Oh. Yeah, I love it. Those are like the ears that flap in the night. <laughs> it's true. I love a retweet, please. Oh, wait, that's not what it said. What did it say? He had a tattoo that says, I love Jen. I would say that even though I know that we would like always be together forever. No, that's a curse. Yeah. No, I would never, ever let you tattoo my name on your body. That's there. It's like proven that that's a yeah, curse. Like even, even though I know for sure. Even people that look <laughs> like are guaranteed to stay together forever. As soon as that tattoo happens. Yeah. I'm not trying to yeah. do anything. Whoa. Oh, these are so fun. Oh, they're, they're doom, doom buggies. buggies. Oh my gosh. So oh, this is I, from it wasn't it's got an interchangeable bow and the bow kind of tipped over. This is from Jen from the Mouse Cierge. Um, like mouse and concierge smashed together. Um, this is so cute. So and it's got the hitchhiking ghosts. 
This is awesome. She just wanted to send a pair of ears over because she started at a shop. So she is from the Mousy Ears. And um, these are pretty fun. Oh, and you can take the bow off too. Yeah. Very fun. That's like a really different style and everything. Yeah. I've never cute. seen that. Yeah. Very neat. Thank you for thinking of me. I appreciate it. And these are really unique. Let's see. Uh, tattoo Tim on yourself. I'm just going to put I love Tim. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's fun. Check it out. Yeah. And so the bows um, can come off as well. So I can just do like a little spooky bow. Oh, retired army going to shades of green after Christmas. Very cool. What is this? That's uh, a thing. Oh, is it? Yeah. Oh no, I need a knife. No, we've already opened it. I thought. Did we open? Did we open this mail? No, I mean like we already opened it and looked at it. Oh my gosh, this is candy. How old is this? I feel so terrible that we didn't open mm. these in time, you guys. This isn't opened. Oh, it is opened. Uh oh. Did I open this? You guys, I am really, really sorry. Um, More theme music. What kind of theme music? I don't know. Name a name a theme song and I will sing it. Um, so really quick, this is from the Hanrahans. Hanrahans. Hanrahans? Um, and they just wanted to send us a small token as their thanks for the vlogs. And... I'm still wait. Oh, DuckTales. Woo. Do, 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 oh, they do. said that they did um, La Cellier for Thanksgiving dinner and they highly recommend it. Oh, nice. Yeah. And that they um, had a trip to Disney. They stayed at Port Orleans um, Riverside, French Quarter, which we stayed there and it was really nice. And um, thank you so much. We really appreciate this. So they mailed over some, like a, a little tin of the Almond Rocas. And it said, I hope these survive the heat. And I feel so terrible because they did survive the heat, but then we never opened this box in time. So let me see. Do you how think they're still they good? Are. They're probably still fine. But let's see. Because I think they're, I think they're, um, if there's no mold on them, they're well, still good. I think they're in little thingies. Oh, yeah, they're fine. Happy this. fourth anniversary. It only looks slightly like a damaged peanut. Oh, no. Oh, yeah. I think they're it, just a little it melty. Did, did melt a little bit. They're fine. Well, we really appreciate that. Whoa, what is this? That might not have been very good. Oh no, are they too old? Maybe. I am so sorry, you guys. We really appreciate you sending over this tin. Um, and we're super sorry that <laughs> we didn't get to it before it went bad. Somebody said you have to eat 500,000 stale almond rockets. <laughs> Um, what's your guys' favorite British candy? British candy. I don't know. What's your favorite British candy? I like an arrow bar. Oh, you know what? Um, Galaxy. Oh, yeah? Mm-hmm. Spider-Man, Spider-Man does whatever a spider can. Spins his web from his hand. Look out. Here comes a Spider-Man. Oh. Everybody keeps saying to get a theme park pigeon tattoo. I mean. Get a tattoo that says Winona forever. <laughs> I think that would be funny. So this is from Viv and Kevin from England. And they um, just want to say thanks for the vlogs. And they were so surprised to see that we could keep our Japan trip such a secret. So mm. they actually planned, they're planning their own Japan trip, which is very exciting. Nice. Um, in the not so distant future. So they're going to hopefully be going very soon. And they were very excited to see like what, you know, like prices and what everything, um, you know, where we would stay and, and all that kind of stuff. So they were very excited for the videos. And they said that um, we can see that you're an amazing and loving couple. We thank you for letting us share in your life so far. Thank you so much. This is so sweet. And they mailed over um, some oh. grommet to design your own grommet. <laughs> That's really fun, Wallace. Oh, are they like it's like coloring pages? Yeah, like you design your own uh, feathers and Wallace and grommets in there too. So that is very exciting. Um, 
But then they also sent over some like some cups. And I really like this, actually. This is a like a camping cup, but it's a Starbucks cup. Whoa. Yeah, I feel it. It's like really neat. And then here's, oh, because Wallace and Gromit is from Scotland, right? So here's a, a Scotland Starbucks mug. Are Wallace and Gromit from Scotland? I feel like maybe. You look. know that the, the place that had all of the original Wallace and Gromit um, here's like all figures of them. burned down? It did? Mm-hmm. See, there's them in like the, I don't know. I'm sorry. I don't know. You have to beauty guru it. Did it work? Focus on my hands. It never worked. Focus on my hands. Let's start back here, and then we'll move forward slowly. It's not working. Uh, this well, camera you guys, doesn't like it. You guys know what they look like, I feel like. Um, happy fourth birthday to Dexter. Also, happy birthday oh, to Ryan. Oh, they're from Yorkshire. Oh, they're Sorry. from Yorkshire. Sorry. And yeah, I, think... I hear they have good pudding there. Oh, no. Sorry about that. Um, and then they sent us in England. Do we have this already? No. I don't think we do. Oh, my gosh. I love this. It's an England You Are Here mug. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. Let's Sorry. See what, let's see what's there. You can see <coughs> Stonehenge. They've got just umbrellas because it rains all the time. A police call box. I love it. So just a house. What else is there? Uh. Tennis. For Wimbledon. Oh yeah. Wimbledon. I almost said it. I thought got, it was Wimbley. This is Brighton Pier. Wimbley's from uh, Fraggle Rock. Why isn't the eye on there? Wouldn't the London Eye be like a big deal? Or oh, like yeah. like Big Ben? Oh yeah. Maybe there's like. Oh, this is all of England. I guess that would be on the yeah, London one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're right. You're right. Gotcha. Um, will you set that over there too? Sure. Cool. Well, thank you. That's awesome. We love that. And <clears throat> hi, Taylor. Do you want to answer some of those now? Oh, yeah. Where did we leave off? Over here. This one. Closet Disney Nerd says, Hey, guys, love your videos. Glad I caught one of your live chats. Well, thank you. We're glad to have you here. Yeah, thank you. Um, Jenny and Ryan says, Ordered a Tim Tracker t shirt last night, a Christmas one. Thank Christmas you. Christmas is coming up very soon. I'm hoping to get some more um, holiday designs made. Uh, we want to give a shout out to Caden in Wisconsin. Shout out. Uh, Martha says, thank you for your videos. Have brought me much joy. Keep up the good work. Love you guys. Thank you. Um, D. Leffer, Leifer says... Thanks for all the tips planning my first trip there next year and asking my boyfriend to marry me. Oh, should we have not like oh. said that out loud? I don't know. Hopefully they're not watching this. Oh gosh. Uh, <laughs> Alex says going to be in Disney in November. I really hope to see you, Tim. You're the most positive person I know. And Aww. thanks for the smiles. Thank you. <laughs> That's what I say. Oh, my goodness. Well, thank you. Yeah. Um, we did get a letter from the Summers family, from Ooh. Krista, Jeff, Jack, and Henry. And they just wanted to say thank you so much for making the video. What? Can we get a monorail shirt for Murray? I Okay, so I do want to do that. That is on my list, but I don't know. I don't want to do a camera noise shirt. There's a, a bunch of ideas that we want to do. But I just don't know, like, how. I don't, I don't know how that shirt. How do you, like, how? That's a good question. I don't know. So I, I got to figure it out. Um, but you, you kind of have to be uh, careful with that because if somebody doesn't know the story behind it, they might think that you're making fun of somebody. Yeah. Like, I, I don't know. It's a tough, that's a tricky one. Yeah. But, um, but I do want to make that shirt just because I love, I love that. That's a good idea. Uh, um, he doesn't so, watch YouTube. Okay. Gotcha. Good. So, <laughs> um, so uh, they just wanted to say thanks for the videos because they um, it kind of keeps them like they're virtual. They can they can be here virtually, so they love that. Oh, and no. so she was inspired by the pin trading vlog that we did. Holy cow! And made us some pin trading ears. That's with, amazing. With a couple of little pins on it. Yeah, these are so fun. And she did say, "I'm not an ear maker by any means," but she just wanted to make these because she thought they were so fun. And like these are so cute. That and, is a brilliant idea. Yeah, and she said that I know that you're not a um, an ear guy, so she gave you a gift card. Oh, you didn't have to do that. No, you didn't, but we really Thank do. You so much. Yeah, that was very, very sweet. Thank you so much. So we can do like lunch one day. Um, 
That's so sweet. Thank you so much to the Summers family, to Krista, Jeff, Jack, and Henry. Thank you. Yeah, thank you for thinking of us. Ooh, somebody wants to know if the uh, Disney dining plan is worth it, and we We've have never no done idea. It. Yeah. We, because you have to be staying. I got some bad information one time, and I thought you could do it without staying on property, but you have to be staying on property to be able to do the Disney dining plan. Uh, so, ding, ding. Oh, somebody named their new dog Bandit. Oh, I love that. Let's say okay. hello to Alex's new wife. I missed it. I think it said Natalie. Oh, no. Hello. Hello, Natalie. Okay, so this next package is from Ford, the Ford family in New Jersey, but I don't see um, a letter. Oh, no. So I, I don't know. I think it was just. Uh, well, this one was also sent last year, so oh. I don't know that we'll be eating these Oreos. Why not? How old are they? Well, like, where's the Best Buy date? Best Buy date. This one says Best Buy October 9th, 2017. This one is November, so this one is probably still good. November 2017? Yeah. Oh, no. Okay. I'll um, eat one. Let me have one. It's, it's Best Buy. It doesn't mean that it's gone bad. Well, so the Ford family from New Jersey, we're so sorry that it took us over a year to open this, um, but thank you for sending us some cool Oreos, blueberry pie and firecracker. Blueberry pie and firecracker are the name of a couple of dogs that <laughs> sound awesome. I think we're, we're down here. Where? Uh, right here? Yeah. yeah. Um, Tiffany Hoffman says, for 500,000 subs, you should react to your first video. Um, that was something that I wanted to do anyway, actually. So I'm, that will definitely be something that we do just for fun. So good. Um, Mario. Nadia says, your videos helped plan our Walt Disney trip at 10th anniversary. Happy anniversary. That's so awesome. Please, you guys, really quick. I'm just reading through these um, super chats, but don't send any super chats because we are just opening mail and we're doing the regular chat today. I just am answering these really quick, but please don't send any more super chats. Um, so um, the taco ninja said, I have a question about your username. How did you think of it? Any funny stories behind it? And what YouTuber would you love to collab with? I think the username thing is really funny because yeah. like you guys are the Tim tracker. Mm hmm. Like, I don't know that people have put that, like, together. Yeah. Like, you're not the Tim Tracker. Right. Like, you guys are the Tim Tracker. Yeah, well, the, the channel is the means. Well, the channel is the Tim you Tracker. You are the Tim Trackers. Yeah. The channel is the system you use to track Tim. Yeah. And I'm Tim. Yeah. So <laughs> Yikes, old, the old Oreos. Yes. <laughs> I just ate very old Oreos. How much, like, why yikes? Do you want the, the popping ones, or do you want to eat the blueberry ones? I'm going to try the blueberry pie. Whoa. Ooh, these look weird. Yeah, they do. Okay, you guys, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, am I right? Get a tattoo that says I love, these smell good. It says I love, ooh. Do you not? Oh, I think they smell good. <laughs> All right, I I'm going to try margaritas. it. I love margaritas. It doesn't taste anything like blueberry pie. This tastes like blueberries. It does taste like blueberry pie a little bit. Like fake blueberry, though. Mm. Oh, yeah, these are bad. I don't hate this. I hate it. I don't love it, but I don't hate it. Mm. I don't know that we are going to dress up on Halloween night. If anything, we would be either one of the two costumes that we wore for Not So Scary. Well, here's the thing. So you guys may not know this, but... Oh, man. It's bad, right? It's like very strong. Yeah. Um, Halloween is our anniversary of when we first started dating. It so is. yeah, sixteen, right? Sixteen years ago. Um, two thousand four. So yeah, no. What year? Fourteen is it? years ago. Fourteen years ago. Fourteen years ago. Is that right? I can't remember. We've been we have been together for a very long time. So that is our dating anniversary, and mm -hmm. so we just were going to kind of take the night off and give out candy and maybe like just make dinner and watch scary movies and how much candy do you guys buy to give out on halloween we bought so much candy <laughs> we bought we bought full-size bars um and we 
we we have something like like sixty four candy bars. You guys are bad at math. Well, wait, what is it? Is it two thousand four to eighteen? Is 14. fourteen? What did we say? We said fourteen. <laughs> Sorry, we are bad at math. <laughs> at least eight hundred pieces. Eight hundred pieces of what? Full size bars. Eight hundred. Five to seven bags. Well, how many did we buy? I think what are you we bought out like a bag to every kid. Maybe. Holy cow! They're trying to be the most like neighbors. How do you Two bags. open this? That makes sense. What is it? Oh, none. You don't give out any. Whoa. I don't know. I don't know that we can open this one because I don't have any. Do you have your keys? No. Oh crap. Uh. I used to have like some sharp, like nail clippers in here. What the heck? Oh, here. There's a pin. So we'll oh, yeah, use we'll this use pin, pin back. So okay, the thing about Five this. Five cases of beer. Let me ask you this. Um, what do you do with your pin back? Um, I feel like I would really lose them. I love these pins, though. You do <clears throat> the same thing as your snapback. You know that thing of when you do your bangs and then you like you don't do them in enough time, so they're just weird for the rest of the day? What? That's me today. I'm going to have weird bangs. Um, I love you. Thank you. This is you a, get a hundred trick or treaters. That's so many. I hope we don't get a hundred. We didn't buy enough candy. We only bought like forty candy bars. Um, no kids in the. Oh, we. There are definitely kids in our neighborhood. I just don't know if we got enough candy or too probably too much. Um, have you ever considered putting both names in the title? What names? What do you mean? Tim and Jen. Oh, gotcha. Is that what so you mean? when when Tim started the channel, it was before we were married. We were dating, but we weren't married, and so I think that was more of just like a smart decision of not to add my name to something until like you knew for sure. I guess I don't know. Well, I think I had the channel well, name. It's kind of like the tattoo thing. It's like if you start a channel with both of your names, what I don't know. Oh no! Is this candy? Oh no. And that's not even like sealed candy. Oh god. I am so oh, sorry. Um this is from Brooke and Brooke is uh from from Pennsylvania. Okay, from Pennsylvania. 500 trick or treaters? Oh, just shut off the porch light when you run out of candy. Oh yeah. Ooh. Daniel's watching this in VR. You are? What does that mean? Like he's watching it with his like his glasses on. So what does it mean though? Like what what do we do? I mean it's the same. It's just the the oh. it's closer to his face. Like this. <laughs> ah. Ooh. Ah. <laughs> Whoa. Um okay, so this is from Brooke and she started watching our videos about two years ago. And so she was in Florida in uh last summer and she spent three weeks competing in an independent study on alligator behavior and now she's an alligator wrestler. Whoa. Um, so she was saying that we should check out Gatorland in Orlando has trainer for a day and okay. it's an amazing opportunity to interact with animals. Just a recommendation. Oh. Um, so we did go to Gatorland back. A while um, ago. I think, gosh, it was probably like four years ago now. Uh, so Maybe yeah. That's, longer than that. Do you think? Yeah. Oh. Definitely oh, wait. a long time. If you watch. Uh-oh. The girl who did the outro of the first time you rode the Frozen ride was a contestant on Child Genius. Wait, what? <coughs> I, I don't, sorry. The first time we rode... <coughs> sorry, I didn't mean to cough on you. Frozen anymore. Ever After. Yeah. Also, in one video, Tim promised to do a video in which he would show his favorite coat racks at Disney. I'm very upset that this was never made. Um, I, ha -ha. I, what? Yeah. I had no idea. It was back when we went to Yak and Yeti, I think. Oh. Um, and then she spent three weeks in South Af in West Africa, sorry, where she got the hippos. Oh, okay. So that's these aren't candy. Oh, I wonder if she misses the rains. Down in West Africa? Down in Africa, yeah. Maybe. Let's see if oh no. Whoa. Oh, how cool. It's like a little carved oh hippopotamus. Gosh. Oops. Um, so the brown one is from Senegal, and the black one is from Gambia. Oh. And I bought these wood animals to give to friends. Oh, my gosh. How fun is that? That is so cool. I love that. The little butts. That oh, is, yeah. like, the coolest thing. Oh, my goodness. I love that so much. Um, 
Thank you both for all that you do. Chocolate hippo. They're like, don't eat it. <laughs> Thank you, Brooke. We really appreciate that. That's really cool. Really cool. I'm just checking to see this person who was the contestant on Child oh Genius. I forgot that I had this microphone on and I just burped into... I'm like, I'll burp over here so nobody can hear me. And you're like, <laughs> burp. Did you guys hear that? Let's hear. I want to see if anybody heard it. Ah, uh, hippo butts. No. 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 Oh, yes. No burp. <laughs> I heard a somewhat of a burp. Okay. Um, Archie just asked, how do we send mail? Um, and right now, there is no way to send mail to us, unfortunately. We did close the box. I know I've already said this a few times, but I want to make sure that I answer that question, especially so that nobody wastes money on uh, sending something that will be returned to them. Yes. Yes. No burp. <clears throat> Hello from Afghanistan. Uh, hello. Thank you, Philip. We appreciate it. Better out than in. That's true. Are adults allowed on Slinky Dog? Yes. Yes. I have been on Slinky Dog at least like eight times. I'm just waiting to see this outro from when we rode Frozen. We did not ride Splash Mountain when we were in Tokyo because it was very cold when we were in Tokyo, but I'm actually really kind of kicking myself for not doing it because I don't, who knows when we'll get back out there. Is this the person that was a contestant on the Genius Show? Let me see. Maybe, yeah. She looks like a little genius. She does look like a like a small version of a genius. Yeah. Okay, let me get... Oh, wait, you're still attached. Oh, shoot. Okay, let me just get a couple of little... Make sure they're open because we don't have the knife up here. Oh, shoot. None of these are open. Oh, shoot. Oh, and we took everything out of here. So we'll have to wait to show that. Um. Well... Well, we've been going for an hour, so let's let's just answer some comments. Okay, but we can't open these? I don't have anything to open them with. <laughs> okay. I'm sorry. What the heck? I forgot that part. We also have some um, other stuff, but I can't reach it. Yeah. Shoot. Are there any What did you rides? do with that pen? I put it way over here. Oh, no. I'm going to try to open this. Are there any rides at Disney that parent, that adults cannot ride? Any rides at Disney that adults cannot ride? I don't think so. No. I think adults can ride all the rides. There is one ride at Universal that adults can't ride. What? Oh, Flight Tornado of the... Man Flyers. Oh, yeah, that. Um, that's my package. This one is? Any Christmas tips? Uh, good you, world, yeah. Goodwill towards men? Somebody said that we could go grab a knife. Um, but if we unhook ourselves from our microphone thing here... It'll yeah. be really loud for you guys. So what we're going to do is the next time that we have a live show, we're going to be better prepared and we will have our stuff right here next to us. Yeah. Um, is Boathouse kid friendly? Yes. Yeah, I think so. They have cute little like um, kids meals that come yeah, in the Amphicars. Yeah. yeah. So let's see. This is from Lynn. Oh. Just started watching a few months ago. Um, Oh, let's see. What's your favorite Disney restaurant out of all the hotels? Uh, California Grill at the moment. So this is like a fun little, I think it's going to be like a photo of Bandit. Oh, no. She said, How do you know? Well, because she said, um, I know you're closing your P.O. box, but I Tim captured this shot of Bandit, and it was too cute not to screenshot and send to you. Thank you for bringing me a little bit of joy each day. If I'm having a tough day, I can look forward to... The guaranteed smiles I will have watching you. Oh, this is so sweet. You two are a blessing on this earth. Love you guys. That's so sweet, Lynn. Oh, my goodness. Somebody said pizza, eggs, and vampire tongue. <laughs> pizza, eggs are delicious, and I'm glad that people are trying it because it's so good. So let's see what do we have here. Ooh. Ooh. It's wrapped so well. Like, this is exciting. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Well, that's fun. Oh, I love this so much. Holy cow. You Look guys, at baby he looks so good. Uh, he does. She said in the letter, she said that this one, this is one happy, comfortable, love dog. And he really is. I'm going to yeah. cry. I can't cry. Don't um, cry. 
Thank you, Lynn. This is so nice. I love it. Thank yeah. you. It's very nice. I love, love, love it. And I love the way you wrapped it, too. It was so cute. I love that. Oh, man. There's something about this couch. What? Oh, it hurts my bum. Your bum? Yeah. Dang, dang. A steak at Disney. I don't think that I've had it yet. Um, I feel like... Everybody says the Yachtsman and La Salier. We had a really good steak at Boathouse. Yeah. We had a filet at Boathouse that was really good. Yeah. So I feel like for now, like for what we have had, I would say Boathouse. Yeah. But we haven't had anything, so. Um, we You have done a video of your tattoos. Yeah. Yeah. We were in the pool. and I, I think just... it's called like Tattoo Tour or something. I think so. I think we haven't been to Narcoosies yet. Tattoo. You should be able to find it. Yeah. Does it get cold there in January usually? I feel like January is one of the colder months. Yeah, but it has been hot in January before. Yeah. So, who knows? Uh, where did we leave off? I don't know. Um, yes, we did say that we closed our P.O. box. It is fully closed. Um, we are just opening mail from, I think this Apparently is from August. Year. Well, <laughs> there was some mail from last year that we missed. Um, but this is from August. So we are so far behind and we just don't have enough room to house any more mail. So we had to close our box. So we're really sorry, but we will be doing more mail vlogs because we need to open this mail. Yeah. So the next mail vlog that we have, I think we'll just really focus on the mail. Cause I, I think that these are going to confuse people because mm -hmm. we're like opening mail, but also saying like, don't send us anything. Right. You know? So we'll have to try to open all the mail, um, as quickly as we can so that we don't confuse people. Hot pot of coffee. <laughs> oh, which I'm so excited. Where'd you put my strip, my um, straws? They're right here. Yay. I want to use them today. Thank you. <laughs> um, let's see here. Nadia, Thank you, Hunter. Sorry. Nadia says, your videos helped plan a WVW trip. Hashtag 10th anniversary. That's Ooh. awesome. Uh, Midget Taco Ninja. No, I already answered all these. You Where did that one already? Yeah. Uh, we're here. Uh, Lex Ventures says, would you guys consider doing a vlogs of things to do around the University of Central Florida? Mm. Sure. Wait, what? Things to do around, oh, the around the University of Central Florida. Yeah. What is there to do out there? Um, I mean, there's like the movies. There's a lot of bars out there. We'll have to do a video so we can figure out what there is yeah, to do. There's Waterford Lakes. <laughs> um, Christina... My husband and I love your channel, and it keeps us in the Disney spirit even when we're freezing in Indiana. Could you say hi to my husband, Matt? Hi, Matt. Hi, Matt. Thank you both for watching every day. We really appreciate that. Uh, Philip, thank you so much. Yeah, thank you. Annie, Annie. Oh, go ahead. Sorry. Says, thank you for wishing Ryan a happy birthday. We are coming down for his birthday, our 10-year anniversary and Thanksgiving. Can't wait to celebrate all three. That's awesome. That sounds like yeah. a fantastic trip. Very cool. Yeah. Uh, Jill, do you want to read that one? That's the last one. Jill says, uh, Sir Willow was a WDW photographer and worked at Bush Gardens. Um, yeah, we know. We've actually talked to him a little bit when we went to, where did we go? Silver Dollar City. Yeah, Silver Dollar City. Well, I met him yeah. at Hollywood Studios one day. Oh, did you? Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 Very cool. Um how far All of the new mini ears have raised from twenty four to twenty seven dollars at oh. Disney. Have they? Ding dang. Um, will we ever reopen our PO box? I don't know. I just don't know. I think that we're at a point now where we just can't house everything. Yeah. So it's not that we don't want to hear from you guys. So we're st okay. We're still going to be doing these live shows so right. that we can hear from you guys here in this chat. Like no super chats. Just want to talk to you guys in the regular chat. Um, but we can't get any more like incoming mail because we just don't have anywhere to put it. Right. So um, I don't know if we'll ever open it back up. I'm not sure. Yeah. Uh, I need the candy floss spirit Jersey. I got one. I bought one for Jen the other day. Yeah. I was so excited. I wore it yesterday cause it was kind of cold and it was like so nice. It wasn't as cold as it was a few days ago, but Jen's like, I'm wearing this. <laughs> the best bathroom in Disney. Ooh. Ooh, I think it's that one at Epcot. That nobody knows about. Oh, yeah. The secret one? Yeah. <laughs> Which secret one? There's two of them, though. There's just one that everybody's like, this is the bathroom you go to poop in. Yeah. <laughs> um, 
What is your favorite college football team? Sports. What is, uh, how do we eat all this food and not gain weight? I think that we do a lot of walking. Yeah. Like to get the food and to like walk around the parks and stuff. But also like, we're not really eating that much food. Well, a lot of times we'll share stuff so that we're not eating a lot of food. Also, it's so expensive. I don't think we could afford to eat. Like, yeah. you know what I mean? So I think like, that's. Take for instance, this week, uh, there were only two days that we kind of ate a little bit excessively. Was it? Yeah. But I feel like because they're not seeing like videos every day of what we're eating, like our dinners and stuff, because our dinners yeah. are usually pretty healthy. Um, they're not seeing that. So they're just only seeing us eat like 10 milkshakes or whatever. Yeah, you know? that's true. <laughs> um, uh, will the mustache come back? Probably not. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> we have been to England. Um, if you search the Tim Tracker England. England, it should pop up. We've been twice, I think now, right? Mm, no. Yes. Wasn't it twice? No. It wasn't? No. I don't know. I'm sorry. Um, we're not doing Blue Apron because Blue Apron ended up being kind of like bad quality towards the end. No, we're it doing was... Blue Apron. We're not. We oh, didn't do sorry. Hello oh my gosh. HelloFresh. We were doing HelloFresh and then everything started coming in like um, like rotten or like bad or opened. And so you couldn't use the thing. Um, Blue Apron has a little bit of that too, but not as bad as HelloFresh. Yeah. So we've been, we've been using it for a while. Hmm. We've been to Old Town. We have a couple of videos on that. Yes. Happy Halloween. We're so excited. Um, I do like Wawa Hoagies. I think they're pretty good. Well, Bandit's doing good. He's doing really good. We're going to do a an update video for Bandit here pretty soon. We were supposed to do one this week, and then the week just got away from us. But, um, but yeah, he's doing really good right now. So we're very happy. James said, thank you from Mass. Also always helps me get my fix of Orlando before I can get back. Thank you. We're happy to be that for you, too. Any plans to visit Shanghai Disney? We got a couple of other places, like another, like I'd rather, I'd not rather, I would like to go to Paris first. I'd like to go to Hong Kong first. I want to go back to Tokyo. I want to go back to Tokyo. Like, I really do think that I need to go back. Yeah. Um, How did you guys meet? We oh, have a video on it, actually. A long time ago. <laughs> yeah. Um, have we done a Disney cruise? I have done a Disney cruise, but it was like 20 years ago. Yeah. So when Disney cruises first started. Yeah. Steak and shake is delicious. Yeah. Um, any tips for a beginning vlogger? We get this a lot and we've answered it, um, a few times, but I think the main, I think the main thing is just do what you like. Yeah. Like, I know that sounds probably really cliche and pretty simple, but if you like what you're doing, it really shows through in the video and you'll be more um, easy to watch because mm -hmm. you love what you're doing and the, somebody out there will also love that thing. Yeah. So. Yeah. Um, oh, okay. So we get these questions a lot too. Um, can you show us like what restaurants to go to with a baby or a toddler or what things to do in the theme parks with a baby or a toddler? Because we don't have a baby or a toddler, um, we can't do that. It'd be very hard Yeah. because we don't have that. So I don't know how we would do that. Yeah. And we also get the question of like, can you show like the process of going to Disney with somebody who is differently abled? Oh yeah. And we and don't, like, we don't have that either. Like neither of us are differently abled. So we can't show you um, the process because they wouldn't allow us to go through the process. Right. Cause we're not. Yeah. So we can't do that either, unfortunately, but I do know that there are people out there um, that have, blogs and blogs specifically tailored around um, both of those things, like with children or with differently abled um, yourself or family members. So yeah. I would definitely search around on YouTube or yeah. just, or Google, because maybe it's a, a blog instead of a blog. Riley said that our videos are so helpful for somebody with severe crowd anxiety. If you're ever in San Francisco, the Walt Disney Family Museum is a must. Yeah, that was something that we... San Francisco We've about is it. on our list. Yeah. Because, I mean, everybody that goes is like, it's cool. You should go to San Francisco. Yeah. So we want so, to. One day. Um, and we're happy to help you with crowd anxiety as well. I know that that's something that I deal with, and I know how um, tough it can be. So we're happy that we can help you. Uh, if it, you couldn't go to Disney ever again, what would you miss the most? That's a good question. The Disney. 
like the whole everything <laughs> yeah <laughs> i think i would miss like seeing the fireworks in the castle and oh yeah that's smart yeah the, the fireworks sort of stuff yeah well that would be sad some people say that they like fast forward through the shows and the fireworks when i show them but i'm like really i like to watch them. <laughs> oh dang yeah um we go we try to go oh, to yeah. what sorry tim i met you on thursday with the old universal jean jacket uh earthquake jean jacket do you think fast and furious oh darn it it got cut off oh no I don't know what he said, but I really enjoyed your jacket. I thought it was very cool. It sounds really cool. Yeah, I met him in Jurassic, the Jurassic area of Universal. Oh, very cool. Um, do you guys use, use yeah. sorry. Do you guys use an external mic with the G7X? You can't. It doesn't plug one in. We just oh. use the regular mic. What's Tim's favorite thing that Jen cooks? I don't, because I cook like new, because it's always Blue Apron meals. Mm -hmm. I never cook the same thing. Yeah. Because it's always just, we get three meals a week from Blue Apron. And then the other meals, we usually do like, I don't know, like soup and a sandwich or like we'll be out somewhere and we'll be yeah. eating. So. What's the most recent thing that you've cooked that I enjoyed? Was yeah. that pizza? Oh yeah, the pizza. The pizza was good. She made a La Four Cheese pizza. Well, you, you, I, well, sorry, I can't even talk. He had to help me make it because it was so hard. Oh, no, that steak was really good, too. Oh, the steak was really good. It was like steak and Brussels sprouts and mashed potatoes. <laughs> they always talk about food. It's true. We do always talk about food. <laughs> well, it's like a necessity. You need food to survive. I just think it's such a relatable thing. Like, we all Why have everybody to Everybody has to eat. <laughs> yeah. um, any plans on moving from Florida? No. No, I think because, like, our whole, all of our families are here. And, like, we've always lived here forever. We've been born here, like... It yeah. would it would be weird to move. We might retire to Japan. Could you imagine? Yeah, I would love that. We we're not really going to do that, but that would be I mean, so like cool. When we're seventy, I don't think that that's how it works. I don't think you can just be like, I'm. I live here now. Why not? Because <laughs> I don't know. I'm sure that's possible. More home vlogs, please. Um, yeah, we. That's something that we'll definitely be doing a little bit more of. There's just been so much going on in like the parks that there's a lot going on. There is a lot. Of <laughs> yeah. Um, I have a, like many questions for David S. Pumpkins. Oh, yeah. Do you have a Blue Apron code? I don't know. Do we? I don't know. I'm not sure. Um, how do you feel? Oh, gosh. Any plans to visit? Sorry, everything's happening very quickly. Any plans to visit? Uh, oh, shoot. Do you use tables in Wonderland? <laughs> I can't. It's happening very fast, you guys. Um, we used to have a Tables in Wonderland card, and then we it the expired. Well, it expired, yeah, and then the price doubled, and we were like, oh, maybe we won't do it. But I feel like we probably would. Yeah, we should. It, we, it, we would we benefit. Would save money that way. Yeah, so I think we will get another one. And they wanted to know if there's any other ways to save money on Disney food. and Sometimes with your annual pass. Sometimes. Sometimes. But other than that, no, there's not really any ways to save on anything at Disney. Did we visit theme parks in England? No, we did not know that the theme parks close in the winter time. So we went in February and yeah. literally all of the parks opened the week after we left. I was so mad. Yeah. So no, we didn't do a single theme park. We went oh, to we went to Eden Project. Yeah, the Eden the Project. like biodome place. We did do that. But other than that. Uh hey Tim and Jen, you guys are awesome. Thank, Thank you, Jamie. You. We appreciate it, Jamie. Patricia says, you probably don't remember me, but I met you at Mickey's Not So Scary right as you were going into your media event. You both wish me happy birthday, but my husband Steve missed you. Our date anniversary is also on Halloween. Oh, I love oh, that. on the uh, 2004 as well. Oh, my goodness. That's wow. awesome. Well, tell your husband yeah. Steve we are sorry that we missed him. Yeah. Um, hello. Hello, yeah. Any plans to visit Dollywood? Shout out to Lucy. We want to go to Dollywood very badly. Yeah, that's what they asked was, did we want to go to Dollywood? Yes, we do. Yes. Um, hello to Jack. Hi, Jack. Uh, would you guys get remarried at Disney? I feel like... Like a Disney wedding? No, it would be way too expensive. Those are very like, expensive. I'm not... We're not... I, we're, that's not us, I feel like. We're not, like, fancy. Right. And that's, like, a real fancy wedding. So we did just buy uh, an espresso machine. Well, I'm, we're not we're fancy. fancy. We're not fancy. <laughs> we got uh, the cheapest espresso machine you can buy. <laughs> well, and then I don't even think we got the right thing. I think we did. Are you sure? Yeah, you liked the, your drink that I made you, didn't But you? I don't think we made it the right way. I made it exactly the way that everybody makes it. <laughs> <laughs> 
Um, let me know if you're coming to Dollywood. I, it's definitely on our list for sure. Did yeah. we go to Gatlinburg? We went to Pigeon Forge uh, a while ago. But isn't that like Gatlinburg? They're similar, yeah. Okay, gotcha. And I've been to Gatlinburg and Dollywood before. Hi, Jake and Jim. Um, sh wh where? Fancy. The vines you guys reference are hysterical. Oh, no. You know what's really funny? So, um, Hi, what's, it, what's his name? The road work ahead. Oh, yeah. Uh, Drew Gooden. Drew Gooden lives in Orlando. And I'm always like, I bet you we'll see him one day. I feel like Tim, somebody asked earlier, like, who our favorite bloggers are. And I think it's like he's maybe your favorite. I think I like Danny better. Yeah. Then, sorry, Drew. I like, <laughs> like, like he's Gonzalez watching this. He's than... like, he's totally watching this right now. Sure. Drew Gooden just slammed his <laughs> laptop closed. Um, I think they're really funny. They're both really good channels. You guys should check them out. Yeah. Um, I miss Vine too. I love Vine. Do you like HHN? I sure hope so. Very much so. Um, what are all the states we visited? Not very many. Like yeah. in our lives? Not many at all, I feel I've like. I've been to a lot, but it was when I was a baby. Yeah. So that doesn't, because my parents used to have an RV and they would take me places. And oh. I like slept through seeing the Grand Canyon and stuff like that. Yeah, see. But I was a baby. Well. So that doesn't count. That's really funny. So um, what is your favorite coaster? Cheetah Hunt. Is it your favorite? I think so. Okay. Like which things? Because it's an Intamin. Oh no. But oh, we also found out that the um, Harry Potter coaster is going to be an Intamin, or it is an Intamin. Oh, gotcha. Um, somebody also asked me to go and show <clears throat> go and show the construction of the supposed rumored uh, Jurassic Park coaster. Where did that rumor come from? I don't know. Like I, I feel like some of these rumors are are a little silly. Well, they're all over in the chat, and they started doing survey markers, and they filed a permit to demolish the trike trail. Oh, really? But like, and stuff like that doesn't mean that anything's coming because um, we don't have a permit for building anything yet. Right. Uh, Ashley said to do a vegan video for Universal, which we got that a lot in the comments of the vegan at food and wine video. Yeah. So I think that we will do that. A lot of you guys were like, there's a whole bunch of new vegan foods at Universal. Yeah, and so. I sent an email to our representative at Universal asking for a full list of them. And oh, so we can make sure we get them all? Yeah, and <laughs> they said that they would get back to me in like a couple of weeks. And I'm like, all right, well, maybe we'll do it before then. Yeah, we'll check it out. Um, you know, somebody just said, left a comment that reminded me of the fact that Red Dead, Re Red Dead Redemption came out. What? And like, I don't play video games, but seeing like there's a bunch of gifts being posted on the internet of people playing it, mm -hmm. and I kind of want to play it. What? I don't understand. It's like a Western game. Yeah, it's like I'm sure there's like a point to it, mm -hmm. but the way that I feel like you play it is you just kind of like roam around the Wild West, being like, it's like a uh, like Westworld. Oh, where you can like do whatever you want to. I'm sure there's like things that you're actually supposed to do. Um, we are going to Iapa this year. Yeah, we're very excited. Oh, they said it's like Grand Theft Auto for horses. Were you guys teenagers in the 80s? No. No, we wow. weren't. How old do you guys think we are? <laughs> we must look real good. Um, we did watch Sabrina on Netflix. Did we finish it? Uh, yeah, I did. You fell asleep through a couple of episodes. Literally every... I think I watched one episode, and I just could not stop falling asleep. Yeah. I don't know why. I just... I wasn't into it. I liked it. I liked it a lot. I really wanted to love it. Uh, somebody just said it's illegal in Ottawa for people over the age of 14 to trick or treat. Really? Yeah. Oh. Huh. It's pretty interesting. Yeah. Gerardo says, hey, do you guys ever cruise or curse? <laughs> no. Cruise. I, I am bad at reading. <laughs> uh, no. I well, mean, like, I feel like I do, but Tim, Tim has asked me not to say bad words on the channel. So I have not said any. In real life, though, I don't, I don't curse. He really doesn't. Um, I think it's really funny. There's no reason to. Well, I don't know. I feel like sometimes <laughs> there's a reason to, but that's why we're different. <laughs> um, X Max says, "When you guys, when are you guys going on Splash Mountain again? I love Splash Mountain. Love your videos." Um, I feel like we can do it sometime soon because it's it's warm enough now. Yeah. Or I guess it has been warm enough for a long time. The new Jurassic World ride was confirmed where? In Hollywood? Who, who can yeah, there's one in Hollywood. I know that was. Yeah, who confirmed it? I don't know. Was it Universal? Because if not, no. Any plans for New Year's? 
What are you doing New Year's? Yeah, what are we doing New Year's? I have no idea. Me either. Last, Last year, year you would, I sorry. went to Epcot. Yeah. Um, maybe I'll go to Epcot with you this year. It's pretty uh, ridiculous. Um, our watch bands are from Target. Well, yours is a Tom's. Mine but is it's like from Target. Target brand. Oh. Be Our Guest, I feel like it is worth going to for the experience of Be Our Guest. Yeah, and that, that prefix menu is pretty good. Yeah, I enjoyed our food a lot. Um, <laughs> ding dang is the closest thing. There are there are some words that I say that people tell me are not acceptable in other countries. Yeah, which I think is very strange. Yeah. So, I guess unintentionally he does. But there are things that people say in other countries that I don't say. Yeah. Um, Will you be giving a review of the remodeled rooms at Pop Century? I don't know. We would have to stay at Pop Century. Right now, yeah. we don't have any plans to stay at Pop Century. No. Uh, uh, Jville Punk says, greetings from Fort Wilderness from the Hansons. Thank you. Yeah. Have fun at Fort Wilderness. It's good to see your username again. Yeah. Jville Punk is somebody that, uh, that's a username that's been with the channel since we started 2009 the channel. Yeah, I feel something. like for, yeah. Maybe 2010. Will you ever come to Chicago? Um, I'm sure maybe one day. There's nothing that's like bringing us there yet? Like, is there a theme park in Chicago? I'm sure there's one close to Chicago. Oh, okay. There's a Six Flags. Oh, hmm, yeah. interesting. Mm -bop. Would you visit Disneyland Paris? Um, I would. I totally would. We just haven't yet. Yeah. We watched all of The Haunting of Hill House. Mm -hmm. I'd like to watch it again because apparently there's like a lot of stuff happening in the background. Yeah. So. Um, what the booty heck? <laughs> what the booty heck? No, like uh -oh. if if you're from the UK <coughs> and Sorry. the word that you used for somebody being really drunk or if you're like making fun of somebody, you're taking the blank out of them. So, okay, really quick. Somebody said that um, I had them eating peanut butter and jelly sandwiches, peanut butter and jam sandwiches. When th That's from an old video. So I'm guessing you're like going back in the videos. Yeah. But when, I, when we did that, a lot of people from the UK – we're like, that sounds terrible. Like, peanut butter and jelly isn't a sandwich over there. Really? Yeah, it's good, right? Like, hopefully you liked it. But I just, I, I was very surprised by that. What kind of jelly? What kind of jam? I don't know. I always used uh, strawberry. Yeah, strawberry is the best. But. A lot of people like grape. And do, I say, heck no. Do a video on Diagon Alley. Um, and we did. We did a whole walking tour video of Diagon Alley. And then we did, like, just a bunch of videos in Diagon Alley because we liked it. Um, we did do a Disney World run. That was fun. Uh, Peanut Butter Freaks. Oh, gosh. Where is it at? PB&J is the childhood staple. Yeah, you have to. It is. It's, it's gross. gross. Oh, oh, no. I love it. <laughs> Grape jelly rolls. Sausage links or patties. Ooh, I think links. Yeah, I'm going to go with links. But I do love a McDonald's sausage biscuit. Oh, yeah. Like, I love that. Yeah. Somebody from the local McDonald's. PR contacted me and wants me to do a sponsored post on Instagram, I think. For, for McDonald's? For McDonald's. <laughs> really? Should I do it? Uh, that's funny. For like what? I don't know. Because when we did the the Uber thing where they like, yeah. if you ordered Uber Eats and got McDonald's. A lot of people thought that that was a sponsored. People thought that it was sponsored. But it wasn't. It was it just wasn't. a funny, like we were, I think we were kind of making fun of people who do sponsored posts. Well, I was just making fun of you the did, fact you that did you did the got, whole like looking yeah. away laughing kind of a thing. I was just making fun of the shirt, really. <laughs> well, but you made it like you were an Instagram model. It's true, because so, I am an Instagram model. Well, okay. <laughs> uh, but should, should, yeah. <clears throat> Excuse uh, me. Mixed flag. What is gravy at breakfast? Ooh, it's so good. Breakfast oh, gravy is so good. Yeah, look up like sawmill gravy. Delish. It's it's sausage. Can uh, you do a tour of the Hard Rock Cafe in City Walk? Yes. Didn't we do that? No, but I have something planned. Oh, okay. I thought we Don't did that. Don't you worry. Okay, sorry. Princess Tim is a model. Yes. Princess Tim. <laughs> um, we don't have any plans to visit Shanghai just yet. Oh, visit Myrtle Beach. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I want to I wanna go to all of the Disney resorts in America. I think that would be Biscuits pretty neat. Biscuits and gravy. Yes, so Biscuits good. Biscuits and gravy is so good. Shout out to Andrea and happy birthday. Um, uh, which annual would you recommend for somebody that lives two hours away? That's I a would, good question. I would do the one that still has the free parking. Yeah. Because I feel like the parking is so expensive now. Um, do you have plans to go back to Shades of Green? 
Not anytime like super soon. Yeah, I don't know what we would go back to show. I don't know. Is there like a restaurant there? Also, they kind of like, uh, I don't think I was supposed to be around Shades of Green. Security kind of followed me around that whole time. Oh, did they? Yeah. Oh. And at one point they stopped me and they said, hey, what are you doing here? And I was like, oh, because the person that is part of the, the armed forces like got me in. Right. And I was like, oh, he was buying his tickets because that's what was happening. Mm -hmm. And the security was like, oh, okay, we got reports of somebody that looked like they weren't supposed to be here going around taking pictures. And I was like, oh, that's probably me. Yeah. And so maybe I... <laughs> maybe we won't. If we're not supposed to be there, we don't want to be there. Like, yeah. we don't want to get in trouble, you know? Um, shout out to Omar. Yeah. Would um, you get a DVC membership? I don't, we would not. Because we live here, there's no real reason for us to have one, I don't think. Somebody said BurgerFi, Shake Shack, or Culver's. Oh, I think BurgerFi. Burger I know that a lot of people don't like BurgerFi, though. Really? I do. I think you're ordering the wrong thing at BurgerFi. I like them. Yeah. It's good. Um, oh, yeah. We should do that. A guy doing space stuff while kicking a caveman in the head. Like the shirt. But you don't want to make it look exactly like the Disney one because then Disney will be mad. So we'll yeah. have to figure that out. Well, also, um, there was an artist oh, that made that. Like that is oh, yeah, an, that's a piece their of art. art. Yeah. You can't so, just like put right. somebody else's art. Sorry. Um, somebody asked us to do the Mickey's Backyard Barbecue because it's closing. I think it's already closed. I don't think it's already closed. No? But it's closing very soon. I don't know if we'll get to do it before it closes, unfortunately. Yeah. A shout out to Scott from the Tim and Jen fan club of Chicago. Is that what it's Yeah. Like? That's awesome. Um, you're so close to 500K. Are you excited? Very excited. Yeah. It's really, um, I don't know. It's like a shock. Yeah. Yeah. Kim says, are there any rides that you avoid? I can only handle Small World once a trip. At Disney? At Disney? I don't avoid anything at Disney. I guess Space Mountain, kind of. Because that can sort of upset my stomach sometimes. I think we avoid long long lines more than we avoid rides. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I can't think of anything that I specifically avoid. <laughs> Shout out to Peggy. Yeah. Um, we don't know when our next live show will be, but we will have one hopefully next week. Yeah. I just don't know exactly when. Um. Ninja Gale says, hey there, do you all plan to return to Branson? The time twister is up and running now. I just got done watching your blog from last year. We do. We want to go back and do Time Traveler. Yes. And I want to go back for Christmas because their yeah. Christmas was amazing. It was really good. It was really good. Um, but, um, but yeah, I think we are going to have to... Call it a day. Yeah, because we've been going for like an hour and a half now. Um, and we are going to... Oh, Summer just asked if there's a vlog today. So this is actually going to be the vlog for today because um, we didn't film anything yesterday. We're very sorry, but... Um, yeah, we took the day off yesterday. We did, yeah. But we wanted to make sure that we still like came and chatted with you guys and opened up some of the mail. So we did get through the mail that we missed from 2017. <laughs> I cannot believe we did that. I am so sorry to everybody um, that sent us mail that we just opened it a year later. I'm so sorry. I feel terrible. Yeah. I can't believe we did that. So the next live show that we do, we will have um, more current mail to open from you guys. But we did want to just make sure that we really, really, really reiterated that the mail box is closed. Right. So please do not send any mail because it will be returned to you. So the mailbox is closed. Right. Uh, J. Bill Punk real quick says... Uh, are you planning to do a vlog about Halloween at Fort Wilderness? My daughter Lily would like to know. Ooh. Uh, I don't know if we'll make it out there because it ends like it, the, the Halloween's tomorrow. Oh, yeah. So we missed it. Yeah. I don't know. We'll have to do that next year, though. That's definitely something that um, a few people have asked us to do. And we just we had didn't get around to it. Right. So next year, we will do that for her. And then KP says... Love you two so much. I'll be in Disney in January, hoping to run into you. Was wondering if you could do a gluten-free in Disney video. Yes. Yeah, it's on our list for sure. A lot of people requested that. So, um, so yeah. Yeah. Uh, go, go back, back and, and delete, delete the PO box yeah. from all their video descriptions. Well, is it in all of them? Mm -hmm. Dang it. Um, yeah, I'll do that. I'm is sorry. There Christmas at Volcano Bay. There's nothing special for Christmas at Volcano Bay. I don't um, even know when they close because they do all all water parks close for a small amount of time during mm -hmm. the winter time, like maybe a month or something like that. I just don't know when it is. Um, also, 
if we oh no yeah <laughs> also we um we just want to say thank you guys so much for coming and hanging out with us we really appreciate it a lot of you guys are asking how we're going to um celebrate 500,000 uh subscribers i don't know yeah i have something that i would like to do but i wouldn't be able to do it right when we hit 500,000 right so i don't know it, it, tim doesn't know what it is but i'm going to talk to him about it and hopefully we can do it i don't know what it is um but yeah so we just want to say thank you guys so much for um coming and hanging out and for opening mail from 2017 with us and <laughs> we really appreciate it yeah so thank you guys so much and yeah. we will uh see you guys tomorrow with a new video oh thank you to the senator uh, we really appreciate that. Thank you for the British money. <laughs> yeah. But Thank you, guys. Bye, everybody. Bye, you guys.